Okay, let's pick up where we left off. This is not rain. This is literally how humid this place is. Mateo Blanco here again. Welcome back to my channel, or if not, welcome to my channel. As you can see by the title, I am actually in Singapore, which is insane to me because obviously we've all seen like the Singapore movie, like freaking insane. I never thought I would actually be here in my life. And it's actually a lot cheaper than what people perceive it to be online because I thought I would never be here. I thought like this was almost impossible, just as how I thought like Dubai was impossible. It's crazy. I'm so glad I'm here. My camera literally just like fell on the floor and now it's with me issues. So I'm recording on my phone right now in case the quality or sound change. But literally India and Singapore weren't in my itinerary at all. And my friend from New York actually saw that I was in India and spontaneously he was just like, you know, you're right next to Singapore. I've always wanted to go. And I said, I've always wanted to go too. And he was like, okay, let's go meet up in Singapore. So I was like, you know what? If there's a chance to go and I'm lucky enough to be able to travel, then let's just do it. You know, um, I would rather like go from India to Singapore than literally go from New York to Singapore. So, I mean, it only made sense to me to say yes. So come out and enjoy Singapore with us. This is my first time in Asia. I definitely want to try like actual street food here because I mean, I see everything online about like street food or whatever, but it's not every day you're in Asia. So, you know, I'm willing to try some things. And I'm so happy to be bringing you guys with me because we get to explore together. First timers, unless if you've already been in Singapore, then my bad. Again, I hate saying this, but like as a Californian who only has like one season like all year, I wasn't aware that other places get cold, other places get hot. And as of right now in Singapore, it's like super incredibly hot. Thank God I brought like summer clothes like from Dubai, but it's like monsoon season, which I didn't know was a season. So it's like raining every single day. I mean, I don't care my makeup stays on my hair always looks like this so it's always cute so i don't care if it's raining or whatever it could be doing whatever it wants to do i'm still gonna enjoy my time and we actually have dinner in a little bit i'm actually just gonna go ahead and change it's gonna meet me up in my room and we're gonna head out in a bit so let's go into the city guys Here's the room tour that literally no one asked for. Um, here's the bathroom, obviously. And you know it's my room when there's a bunch of alcohol already set up. The room was fairly small, but it did its job. So I was still happy. I had such a great view. In the far distance is Chinatown, which is where we spent most of our time. Fun fact, I asked the taxi driver why there's like so many plants 
in every single building like it looks so futuristic but apparently there's like a law or like a rule or something that if you destroy a part of the land of singapore to make a building in general this only counts for like downtown singapore but if you destroy land you have to put the equivalent amount of land that you destroyed and integrate it into your building so obviously this was like a big forest or whatever and if you destroyed like a piece of the land then you have to create real plants like throughout your building and it can't be like plants in pots or it can't be like fake it has to be like full on like real greenery like produce oxygen and it gets super hot in here so the plants actually make it a bit more livable here and i just thought that was amazing i mean you guys are gonna see i'm gonna unblock everything but let's get ready because we have to head out in just a bit and everyone knows i take long so let's finish getting ready was so out in the open I had to record it. Right after the botanical garden we went to Chinatown and I literally tried looking everywhere for some street dumplings but no one had any so we just went to the hotel bar to pregame for the night. So me and my friend decided to go to the temple to get our blessings for the year. All right, guys, we're in Singapore, and I'm gonna try this octopus or calamari. <laughs> Squid. Squid. Oh. <laughs> None of the above, I guess. It's my first time. Bon appetit. Excuse me? Yeah. But if you don't start, you think it's a little bit of 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 You say that like you tried frog, like you just ate a fucking frog before it didn't taste like a frog. Yeah, I did everything already. Oh, you did? <laughs> Thank you.